Hi everybody, welcome back to Simply Marion. I am here to this evening to prepare a lunch. I want to get um, some lunches ready for the two days that I have left in my work week. And I don't know if you guys saw, but I, I um, did a short about a peanut butter and jelly sandwich, cheap and quick. I was hungry. <laughs> So although the peanut butter and jelly sandwich was good, it wasn't enough to really sustain me throughout the remainder of my work day. And so I just said I'm going to go ahead and prepare some, some meals, some chicken salad, and see if I can season some chicken and go from there. So if you want to see what I'm going to make for lunch or you're interested in making my lunches with me for the remainder of the work week, stay tuned. Okay, y'all, this is my chicken salad, and I think it looks delicious. I added another egg to it, and it is so moist, and so I didn't have to use so much mayonnaise. I used olive oil, and I haven't tasted it yet, but I'm going to pack it up, let it sit overnight, let it chill, and it should be absolutely delicious for my lunch tomorrow. Now I'm off to the chicken.
So guys, I am adding my olive oil to my pan, let it get hot. I have marinated my chicken in the bag, a Ziploc bag, and let it soak a little bit. My camera died, so I couldn't quite show you, but I am transferring it to my flour bag. I'm just going to coat, coat it lightly, let it fry five minutes on each side, and then add water and flour to make my gravy and my onions and scallion. And I just let it simmer for maybe 30 or 45 minutes, and I had my meals. So while the chicken is cooking, I wanted to share something with you. My KitchenAid. Okay, so here's my KitchenAid. We are going to be using it to shred up some chicken. We've are cheese, not chicken. We've already tried one size, but we're going to go with the larger shredder size. And as you can see, it's already in there. And here is the results of some of the cheese that we've already shredded. It's pretty good. Works pretty good. So we're going to try the larger hub again. So um, here we go. is number five. So here we go. And it does a good job. My own. So I'm adding my vegetables now to um, a little olive oil I placed in a pan going to add some kale and some Asian vegetable mix that I also had in a freezer for variety and I am closing in on completing my meals. Um, I hope you all are enjoying this um, video. It's not easy to, to really record these cooking videos so I want you guys to enjoy. Leave me a comment. I would greatly appreciate a subscribe and a like if you would. Thank you. Alrighty, here's the finished product. Here is my meal prep for Thursday and Friday. I have some smothered chicken legs and some mixed Chinese vegetables, which I added some extra kale on it for um, more flavor and more veggies. And again, in the smothered chicken, it's just onions, um, a regular onion, a yellow white onion, and then there's the scallions that I added in there with my seasoning. So this is the end result. Thanks for watching. Okay, y'all, I have finished the meal prep for my couple days left on at work, and I am tired, but I feel accomplished. I feel um, very good for. Um, preparing my meals and preparing myself to eat healthier and to live a be better lifestyle and I am going to do my skin care and I am going to say good night and I may come back on one more time I may not but I'm going to take this stuff off my face and just prepare myself for another day tomorrow take care